Okay, so APL animations. Uh, I've put a video up uh, recently demonstrating it, uh, and some people have asked me how I did it. So I'm going to hopefully try and explain it uh, for you now. Let me just give you a demo of what I'm talking about. Uh, da -da -da -da. Welcome to Mighty Cards. Say yes to jump straight into a game, or say tutorial to get a rundown of how to play. So as you can see, those cards come flying in, uh, and I've got some kind of shaking animation uh, happening on those. Uh, same with the logo up at the top, um, and at the bottom there is some text that kind of rotates through. Uh, but if I just go into the skill a bit more. Great. You have the starter deck and the super duper premium 8 bit deck pack. Okay, so which no, would you like to use? There's no animation on this bit, it's just that there's a bit of lag on each image loading in, which makes it look like there is, but there's not. One vibe. One world. Versus. The Bride. Lost to me. Choose a power type and a twist colour. So, and as you can see, the cards as they come in again, they've got a similar type of effects um, animating on those. Same with the logo and the text at the bottom. So, how did I do it? So, um, it's actually um, simpler than I thought, but it took me ages to figure it out. And I needed a, a bit of help along the way. Um, so if you're one of the people that have helped me, thank you very much. Um, first of all, I want to give a shout out to uh, this guy on GitHub. Is it Arjun G? Arun G? I'm not sure how it's pronounced. Apologies. But he's got this really amazing um, resource file with a load of different animations in them. Um, so these are APL commands. And he's given each one a name. So, um, for example, this one is called Bounce. Uh, and within there, he set all the kind of uh, animation um, commands that are happening uh, sequentially in there. So you can see what's happening. And again, here's another one called Flash. I'll put a link to this in the video if you want to uh, use it. Because what I did in, in here is essentially is I took the animation styles that I wanted uh, and put them into my own file. So if we go over to the APL authoring tool, quick look at my code, you see there's 27 lines of code uh, that um, do this for me. And if I just flick onto a different hub, you'll see the animations working in there as well. Um, so if there's only uh, 27 lines of code, how can that be? Uh, well, it's because the file with all the, the fun stuff uh, I'm importing uh, from my S3 bucket um, and that's got all the, the commands on my layout in there as well. So to show you what that looks like, here it is. So this is um, got all the commands in which you saw on the GitHub, so example bounce. It's there, like that, uh, and these are the ones I decided to use. So I've got flash, jello, bounce, rubber band, shake, ta-da, wobble, fading right, sliding left, sliding right. Um, and then I've got my layout as normal. But then what I've, I've done is I say when that uh, image in this instance has been mounted, so it's loaded up, I suppose, on uh, the echo screen, then I tell it to do these commands sequentially, so one after the other, and then I just reference the name of the animation that I want to run, so for example, sliding left, there's a delay and the duration of, in this case, one second, so uh, that's how long 
that animation is going to last for before it then goes on to the next one. Uh, but you can also put in an idle, so this is one second where it's not doing anything essentially. Uh, and then it will call the next one, ta-da, um, with a delay and a duration of half a second. Uh, and it'll just keep listing, listing them. And then again, I've got another image uh, when it's mounted on. I run um, these commands sequentially. And what you can do is play around with the times, so uh, the delay and the duration, so you can kind of get the um, each image. Um, essentially, what I've done is they're running the same uh, animations, to just the delay um, on them, uh, which makes them look like they're coming in one at a time. Um, yeah, and you just keep doing that, fill your boots until you're happy, play around with it, um, and then you get working. Uh, animations in APL. Um, I really enjoy doing doing it and it's something I'm going to be exploring a lot more uh, and if anyone's got some really cool ideas on what you'd like to see in um, APL animation um, let me know because I'd love to um, get some ideas for things to try out um, myself so that is how I did the APL animations uh, for the skill mighty cards so I hope you enjoyed this I hope it's given you enough information so you can give it a try yourself thanks for watching